In my personal experience, especially the past couple years with online classes in school, apps, websites, and extensions can be super useful for studying and productivity. So in today's video, I'll be talking about some great free ones other than the ones shown here that I literally mention in almost every single one of my videos. So first up are two extensions that enhance your tabs when you first open your browser. So while these aren't directly tied to productivity, they make studying and working a lot more fun and engaging, which is always a huge plus. So Momentum is one you may have seen already over on Instagram or Study Talk. And meanwhile, Tabby Cat, my personal favorite, features a new cat or animal of your choice if you don't like cats. Every time you open a new tab and you get daily goodies that you can place on the screen as well and give to the cat. And they have different names and different types and it's really fun and you always see a new cat and I am obsessed with this extension. So Kami, I think that's how you pronounce it, is a PDF editor used by lots of teachers and it's also really great for students as well. So the free version allows you to draw on PDFs, write text, highlight, and even add comments, which is super useful. And it also converts scanned documents to PDF format. So this is great extension for anyone who regularly has to read PDFs and wants to directly annotate on them without an iPad or tablet. So the next extension is Identity, a big thanks to them for sponsoring today's video, which helps you organize your digital life in one place. So Identity acts as a home screen for the internet and allows you to have all of your important websites organized into tiles, kind of like the apps on a phone. As you can see here, I've created categories for school, socials, and a few others. And when I click on a tile, their Chrome extension automatically fills in my username and password, which is super convenient. And over here on the side, they have a notes feature where I like to keep my to-do list and other random notes. So in the note and lists area, I can write down everything I need to get done. And the most convenient thing is that I can link the tiles that I have by using the plus sign and writing out the name of the website. Or if you prefer, you can just add the tile down here and find the one you need. So identity is completely free to sign up and I highly recommend checking it out. So the link is in my description box. So Google Dictionary is an amazing extension I would recommend for anyone who regularly finds themselves looking up definitions of certain words <clears throat> me. It allows you to highlight and double click any word on a website and immediately see the definition of the word right there. Google Dictionary also goes along great with another extension, Weva. which allows you to highlight on websites. So you don't have to copy and paste it into a document or write it down somewhere else. And you can just highlight it on the website and check it later. So both extensions are great for anyone who regularly reads research or articles.
Oh my goodness. Stella, do you want to join the kissing party? Um, sure. Boy, I need only kiss my feet. What do you want me to? To put on the desk. Okay. So for the video. There. There. Is this approved? Director Munchkin? <laughs> Don't me pet her. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Is this good? Oh my goodness. So much energy. Oh my.